I'm going to change to English. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening, guys. Hello, how are you? Good, teacher. How about you? I'm just great. How was your day, Vladimir? Well, right. That's okay. A lot of things to do, but no news, good news. No news, good news. That's cool. Yes. Teacher, uh, I got another question. Well, I, I guess that I understand the lesson from yesterday. If I went with my wife to the supermarket and we're near to, to the cashier and she's she's gonna pay i'm gonna pay and i tell her and no problem i'm going to pay with my credit card that's that's one example yes, but it's if, an intention if, that's it was uh, al revés. What do you say al revés? the other way around and the other way around if if i i'm if i want i want to pay but she tells me and I, I'm gonna, I'm going to pay with my credit card. No, no problem. I'm paying in cash. Yes, that's correct. Okay, I got it, teacher. Thanks. No problem. You apply it perfectly. Okay. That's great. That's great. Alfonso, <laughs> I texted you. So, Vladimir, how was your day? Tell me. Good teacher, and uh, today it was relaxed. I, I told you to Alfonso that I, I need to to do uh, my homework from the master. I need to compare two loves from, from electronic, electronic business. Yes. Yes, uh, the love from from UN and the love from what is what is it? Ley de Comercio Electrónico from El Salvador. Do we have one? Ley de Comercio Electrónico. That's the name. Law it doesn't have such place. Law yes. for e-commerce. E okay. Ah, e-commerce law from El Salvador. Uh, um, what is that? Let me check. In, in, in. Do we have a law for that? Wow. Yes, the, because the subject is uh lceo uh, ley de comercio electrónico that's the name of the subject e-commerce law e-commerce no the subject from the master yes and oh, it's e-commerce the hardware is compared to laws la the un the Unidas, and from el salvador oh really i didn't know yes. we we have that law in el salvador ah uh, yes that's interesting. Uh, well, <laughs> I'll try to understand the, the laws because I'm a lawyer. Okay, so how is the homework coming along? Como va la tarea? <laughs> Actually, I only read one law from El Salvador. I need to to start to read the ne the ne the other law. 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 law, the other law, and then uh, do the compare. Okay. Now, when you say that word, when we say law, it's always round, a little bit more rounder. Law. Law. No. Law. Okay. We made a space. Hacemos como un espacio dentro de nuestra boca. Vocalizamos. Imagínese que en su boca adentro estuviera haciendo esto. Law. 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 Like law. that. Perfect. Law. Yes. Okay, that's Thanks. correct. That's the law. that's the that's the tips for the good pronunciation that I told you, Alfonso. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah. You know, with those, the thing is this. Remember, it's another language. We vocalize different. Yes, that's right. But don't worry. With the practice and more practice, it would come along. So don't worry. It's easy. Uh, okay. Well, thank you, Vladimir. Thanks, teacher. No, thanks to you. Thanks. Welcome to the class. Mr. Ruiz, you better? Walter. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? I'm mm, fine. You better today? Yeah, mejor? Yes. That's great. That's yes, great. I feel really bad. 
Okay, but how was this day? How was your day? Tell me. Mm. Uh, very, very busy the morning, but the afternoon it was more relaxing. Oh, really? So yeah. it was a calm day. Uh, yes. Well, a balanced day. The morning was busy, yes. but the afternoon you relaxed. That's yes. That's she cool. is good. The morning is very crazy, but the afternoon it was okay. So, ah, it was okay. That's nice. Well, yeah. well, welcome to the class, Walter. <laughs> Teacher. Alfonso, good evening. How are you? Hi, Teacher. Good evening. I'm fine. Hello, hello. How was your day, mister? A little tired, Teacher. Oh, really? Many uh, activities yes. to perform? I just uh, got home uh, re recently. Hace poco acabo de llegar a casa. If you tell me I just got home, no es necesario el recently. Because when you okay. say I just, me está diciendo acabo de. Ah. Okay. I just got home. Oh, really? What time did you finish working today? It's the new project. In, 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 ¿Cómo se dice en, en, en el trabajo, en la oficina, nuevo proyecto? In my workplace or in the company? My workplace. Oh, really? And what's yes. the new project about? Is the of the installation, the new machines. Or machines. New machines. Machines. Okay. Uh, what are the machines about? The machines for for the parking lot? I remember you yes, told me you were with those machines. Okay. Yes. It's but, a new project, the, the installation. Oh, really? New uh, machine? In, in, installation. Yes. In, this is uh, this is project in uh, in otro lugar. In another place? In another location? In another location, correct. In another location let me text that word for everybody oops in another location oh okay that's good excellent so i mean if there's work it's always good if there's more activities it's always good siempre que hay trabajo bueno yes <laughs> that's cool nothing that's... more nothing more uh, por breve tiempo teacher what do you cambio mean? De cam cambio de horario. Oh, really? You are going to switch uh, schedule? ¿Va a cambiar horario? Eh, pero solo mientras dure el proyecto. Oh, really? And what's going, what's your schedule going to be like? Quiero ver este... De 8 a 4 me parece. De 8... At from eight to four. Eight to four, four p.m. Correct. Okay. What you asked me for was for a brief period. For a brief period. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, with that word, uh, the only thing is this: that the word brief got different meanings when we say brief we are saying a uh, we are saying periodo but also uh, in a legal environment or perhaps uh, yes it could be this it could have this other meaning the word brief you know Or you can also say, you can use the word brief. Brief means breve, but also el su sumario. What is sumario? Mm. Mm. <laughs> and how can I say that? Uh, la minuta? 
Guys, help me out. How do I express this? Ok, ok, hold on. It's like this. We have a meeting. Tenemos una reunión. And you okay. take notes of the meeting. Ok. So those notes of the meetings, you prepare like a, like a summary. Usted prepara como un resumen. That summary. Uh, yes. Uh, like a, ayuda a memoria. Memories. Yeah, it could be. That could be a brief also. También eso podría ser un brief. Mm. Okay. When you are okay. going to present uh, the information, imagine that you had a meeting. You took notes of the meeting. And then you have to present it to someone else. Y usted luego tiene que presentar las notas a alguien más. So you present a brief. Okay? Okay. That's, yeah, that's a summary. Man, it's, it's just that those are words that I know, but <laughs> I don't use quite regularly. Son palabras que conozco, pero no las uso regularmente. But brief also means uh, breve. Okay? Like a brief, okay. a brief explanation una breve explicación in your case oh. a brief period of time period of time period of time period ah period of time okay so you're going to change the schedule oh that's mm, complex <laughs> what about you do you prefer the schedule you had before or the one you are going to have mm. For me, yes. It doesn't matter. Yes. No, no problem. The expression, a... the expression is like this. It doesn't, oops. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. No importa, dice usted. Ah, no importa. Yes. Me da igual. It doesn't matter. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry, Alfonso. Yes, Vladimir, tell me. It is, but for that word that you told to Alfonso, is uh, another word is whatever. It's like that. No. It doesn't matter? No. no. Whatever is more impolite. Yes. The thing is this. Ah, sorry. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> the thing is this, that, <laughs> that I tell, imagine that uh, Sonia is telling her kids off. Imagínese que Sonia está regañando a sus niños. And one of the kids tell her, whatever. Oh, come she gets on. Like, she gets like, like oh. uh, Teacher, she applies la ley de la chancleta. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you see, that's whatever. But here we were saying like, you tell me, hey, teacher, uh, me dice, uh, do you want to imagine that we are going for a trip? Vamos en un viaje. And you tell me, uh, do you want to go first or do I go first? Let me say, va a ir usted primero o voy yo? And, and I tell you, oh, it doesn't matter to me. No hay problema. Me es igual lo uno o lo otro. But it's, it's not impolite. If I say whatever, that's like, uh, that's not proper. Okay. I got it, teacher. Sorry. <laughs> okay, perfect. Thank you, Alfonso. Thank you, Vladimir. Thanks, teacher. Mr. Luis Armando Leiva, good evening. How are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Hi. everybody. Hello, Luis. How was your day, mister? Well, uh, I had a social day. Oh, really? Really? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, all day I was preparing a, a report uh, oh, really? of the water system. Yeah. Um, but, but tomorrow... Uh, I thought days because I I had to get up very early and at 4 a.m. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's early. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I had to go to to Osikala. Oh, that's time. far. See, si. how long does uh, it take you to get um, from here to Osikala? That's like, uh, wow. Sorry? How long does it take you? ¿Cuánto le lleva? From here to Osicala. Oh, um, three hours. Three hours. Three hours. Uh, See, it's far. Um, it's pretty um, far. I, I, I get out to, uh, 
attend a meeting with my boss at 9 p.m. All right. A.m. Sorry. So and the re return or 2 p.m. is a very hard day for me. Okay. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> but, so tomorrow yeah, is going but, to be interesting. Va a tener un día interesante. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes. But I I will be here tomorrow. That's cool. That's cool. That's excellent. When we finish the class, <laughs> go right straight to bed. Cuando terminemos, directo a la yeah. cama. Yeah, because you're <laughs> yeah, going teacher. to drive a long way. Are you going to drive? Va a conducir? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I, I it's drive a long the way. pickup. It's a long yes. way. Es un viaje largo. Yes. Yeah, yeah. But, well, uh, be careful. Be así, safe. Así, así toca. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know, I know. Well, be safe. It's my work. You know this expression that I tell you, be safe? Es una expresión. What? Be safe. It's like, uh, cuídese. It's, Tiene cuidado. Okay. Be safe. Oh, okay. Th thank you. Okay. Thank, thank you, you Luis. Yeah, okay, I know, I sure. know. A long way. A long way. Long. Oh, okay. Long way. Okay. Yes. Un largo camino. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Luis. Yes. Okay. Sonia, good evening. How are you? Hello, I'm fine. How was your day, Sonia? I uh, had a good day. I prepared a report. I check, uh, check the first part, the um, service for incentive payment. And I meet with the service evaluation area to check and analyze um, how do you say reembolso or reintegro? Oh, mm, reimbursement. Reimbursement. Huh? Reimbursement. Reimbursement. Así. Yep, reimbursement. Reimbursement. Ah, okay. And, and check and analyze our reimbur reimbursement. Así. <laughs> yep, reimbursement. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Only that. Only that. Eh, oh, bueno. ¿Cómo es entre otras cosas? Among de rutina. other things. Entre among, otras cosas. Among other things. Among other things. Uh -huh. on, among other stuff. Among other stuff. Okay. So, I really like it. You work a lot and you say, oh, it was good. Like for me, when I prepare reports, that's not good. I hate reports. And that's terrible for me. Um, era un reporte fácil? It was oh, okay, okay, okay. As we are talking about as we are talking about reports, como ya estamos hablando de los reportes, you tell me it was an easy one. It was an, it was easy, an one. easy one. Uh -huh. Yes, exactly. Because, ya, ya yes, because we were already talking about the report. So, very interesting. Thank you very much, Sonia. Let's okay. see, let's see, let's see. Who else do I have here around? Mr. Walter Arana, hello, good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher, good evening. Hello, Walter. How was your day, mister? Is, is my day was very busy is preparing reports preparing to pay career on salary preparing report to pay career on Saturday oh really then yeah then I made payment to suppliers okay. and we also and I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm going to stop you Payments to suppliers. Okay. Payment to suppliers. Perfect. And we also had an external audit. 
Ooh, that's something different. How how did the audit go? ¿Cómo les fue? Mm, well, they only get to ask for document and report. Documents. Document. Documents. Report. Documents. Documents. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. I I hate audits, man. I remember whenever I was audited by the for the ISO. Man, that's terrible. Recuerdo cuando nos auditaban para la ISO. That's terrible because I had to present a lot, a bunch of paperwork every year. Yeah. Terrible, terrible. Well, thank you, Walter. Thank you, teacher. Let's see who else is around. Mauricio, hello. Let's see, I think Mauricio is still with trouble with the connection. But there's Evelyn. Hello, Evelyn. How are you? Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm just great. Excellent. How was your day, Evelyn? <coughs> Good day. <coughs> This day, I am. Um, I have uh, many activities. A uh, little. Okay, you look a little bit tired. La noto cansada. A few. A little bit. A little bit. A little. A little bit. Yes. A little. Um. How how special. I'm sorry, you blocked your microphone, Evelyn. How I spell it? A bit? Bit, bit, B I T. B I T? B I T. And the question is this one. Y la pregunta que usted tenía que hacer era esta. How do you spell? How do you spell? How do you spell? How do you spell bit? B I T. Okay, the good thing is that you are here in class. Thank you very much, Evelyn. Welcome. Hey, Edwin. Hello, mister. Hello, teacher. Oh, good evening. Tonight is the long night. Yeah, teacher. <laughs> yeah, I can see, I can see you are in your workplace. So tomorrow you rest and tomorrow night you don't work, uh, right? No. You work uh, again until Friday, not Thursday. Wednesday, uh, day off. Thursday night. Okay. Um, Friday, day off. Okay. And Saturday? Saturday, uh, tengo. I bueno, have. I have, I have uh, exam. Oh, really? Uh, other, other exam to driving. Really? Sí, sí. A, a driving exam? Yeah. Examen de conductor? Sí. Yeah, teacher. Okay. So that one is not an exam, it's a test. A and test. Nueva. En este caso es una prueba, a test. Okay. So you're gonna get a license. Va por una licencia. Are we? Sí. Okay. What type of license are you looking for? Sorry. ¿Qué tipo de licencia es la que va a tomar? Eh, la Liviana. Yeah, that's the given name. Es el nombre propio de ella en español. So, Liviana. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because in, in the United States, they, they go by categories. Ahí en Estados Unidos van por categorías. Okay? Yeah. They got letters. It's like the, es similar a la, a la internacional. It's by categories. Oh. Uh, okay, that's cool, that's cool. Be careful. Drive <laughs> safely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I need to go take a test again. Well, I actually need to go take the test for for the license, but for a motorcycle. Oh. 
tengo que sacar Mothers. la motocicleta. Yes. The one for cars, I, I have it like for many years. Yo, I have miedo oh. de andar en motocicleta. Okay. I am afraid. Afraid. I am afraid of riding. Okay. I am afraid of riding motorcycles. Motorcycles. Yeah. Ah, that's easy, man. Este es lo más fácil. Eh, no ese es el problema. It is no problem. The problem is accident through years. Oh, you had an accident. You had an accident. Okay. Sí. Say with yeah. me. I had an accident. I had an accident. Three years ago. Oh. Three years okay. ago. So did you collide? Choco. Eh, nos hicieron sacado de la calle, de la oh, carretera. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Y me fracturé, pasé seis meses incapacitado. Oh, my gosh. What did you break? Eh, la rótula, la rodilla. Ok. Rodilla es mi. Mi. Pero la es rodilla. exactamente, no es la rodilla, sino que es la rótula, el eje principal de la rodilla. Ok, that's the ball joint. Ball joint. Yes, that's the ball joint. I'm going to text it to you. The ball joint. The ball joint. Ouch. Yeah, you have, I mean, it takes long to recover from that. Lleva yeah. tiempo recuperarse. Uh, Oh, I, it, the problem, it's the problem. Uh, I have two operations. Surgeries. The lax, the uh, lapso, no sé cómo se dice. In the last, in the lapso. Yeah. Three yeah. weekends. Oh, three, really? Three weeks, yeah. In a three weekend, three weeks period. No, weeks, weeks, weeks. In three sorry. weeks, in three weeks period, you have two you undergo undergo yeah. se undergo. Se yeah. you undergo two surgeries uh, yeah riding a motorcycle is dangerous they say yeah, uh, yeah. I, 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 I look in I look in yeah I've seen words I have seen yeah. words he visto Ah, he visto. Uh -huh. I have seen words. He visto peores. I have seen words. Yeah. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Well, in my case, I haven't fallen yet. Yo aún no me he caído. So, I'm ex <laughs> Yeah, but that, I mean, there are two types of riders. Solo hay dos tipos de motociclistas. Los que ya se cayeron y los que se van a caer. <laughs> as simple as yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I haven't fallen yet. And I don't run that much nowadays. Yo ya no corro mucho. I mean, 100, 110 tops. 100, 110 lo más. Ni, ni nosotros. Yeah, but... Sí, I, I, accidents, I, 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 I can... accidents are like that. No, I'm telling you because when I was younger, I used to run more. Because, I mean, in my case, the fastest I run was uh, was this. 180. Yeah. One, 180 in a, in a 450. In a 450. 180 <laughs> kilometers per hour. <laughs> I, I used to love running. Me gustaba correr. But I was young. Now, uh-uh. No more. Okay, thank you, Edwin. Interesting. Thanks, teacher. Arvin, good evening. Welcome to the class. Good evening, teacher. Hello, how are you? How was your day, mister? Um, I come entering my house after a um, day of work. You just got home? Acaba de llegar? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. You, um, say, it, you say it like this. 
You say it like this. Lo dice así. I just got home. I just got home. Okay. I, I just got home from work. Okay. I just got home from work. Mm, okay. All right. But, uh, yes. So it was a long day for you today. Um, good day. Okay, pero largo. A long day. A long day. Un día largo. Okay, well, welcome to the class. Yeah. Relax, breathe, respire. Okay. Don't worry. Thank, Thank you very you. much, Arvin. Let's see, Susana. Hello, Susana. How are you? Hello. I'm oh. fine. Tell me, how was your day? Was busy, but productivo. Productive. Productive, very productive. Okay, and tell me what did you do today? What activities specifically I... did you do? Okay, today begin to to process for contract. Oh, really? Yes, to clients new. It's good. To new me. clients. To new clients. Ah, okay. To new clients, and this is good for me. I I have um I no sé cómo decirlo. Bueno, igual en español. Tell me. Que me ayude, o sea, eh, terminé un informe. Okay, que I... me pedido desde no, pero pero es que la idea era no era así tan fácil. Terminé algo que me pidieron en enero. Okay. Entonces, Okay, un alivio. They requested something. Okay, you told me I finished. I finished something that was something. requested from me. No, was requested for me to do since January. This is the specific idea. I finished something that okay. was requested for me to do since January. Cool. That's <laughs> nice. That's nice. Okay. Well, we have to be careful with procrastination. You should never procrastinate. Yes, procrastinate. I'm sorry. Procrastinate is when you postpone something for later and later and later cuando postponemos ah, okay. yes, para mañana, yes. mejor mañana uh, luego más tarde yes. en un momento and we are like postponing all the time that's to procrastinate we have to be careful with that welcome to the class susana no. interesting thank you okay guys let's see hello elizabeth welcome uh, elizabeth Hello. Welcome. How are you, Elizabeth? Fine, sure. Okay, okay. It's good to have you here in class. I'm going to get the attendance, Elizabeth, so be ready. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see. Alfonso Antonio Cabrera? Present teacher. Arvin Enrique Ramos Mundo? Present teacher. Berta Maritza Molina de Villalta, no here. Claudia Guadalupe Alfaro, no here. Daisy Elizabeth Celaya. Present teacher. Thank you. Edwin Daniel Sevillano Deras. Present teacher. Evelyn Patricia Caballero de Molina. Present teacher. Ivania Elizabeth Rodríguez Ramos. Here yet. Karen Lizette García Rodríguez, no here yet. Luis Armando Leiva Rodas. Present teacher. Mauricio Arnoldo Quintanilla Cuellar. There. Oscar Armando Rodríguez Rodríguez. Here. Ricardo Alberto Hernández Monge. No here. Roxana Claribel Trejos. No here. Sandra Yanira Moreno Sarabia. Let me just check. No here yet. And Sonia Mabel Lazo González. Present teacher. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present 
Okay, she's here. Vladimir Antonio Martinez Molina. Present teacher. Walter Alexander Arana Cortez. Present teacher. Walter Jose Ruiz Ayala. Present. Perfect, thank you very much. Okay guys, today as I told you yesterday, we were going to run, we have a lot of information to cover, but it's always good for us to have this little conversation at the beginning so we can like start, we help our brain to start and to get into the English environment. That's why we always do the part of the conversation. Now, today we are going to be working with a lot of information, mostly related with the present continuous used for future and also present continuous when we talk about situations that are happening in the moment we are speaking. We're going to cover all those two at the same time today. So it's going to be a very interesting class and we are going to have two dialogues. We are going to be working on the exercises from the book. Do you remember that I told you yesterday that you were supposed to finish some exercises from your from the manual? Did you finish them? Well, I hope so. And I know that some of you are like trying to get everything I'm saying because I'm speaking a little bit faster. Sé que algunos están tratando de hacer el esfuerzo de entenderme porque estoy hablando más rápido. But the situation is this, guys. Okay. I am starting to speak faster to you in all classes. Voy a comenzar a hablarles más rápido en las clases. Because actually that's my normal level of speaking. That's my usual rhythm of speaking when I'm speaking in English. Este es mi ritmo natural. I speak in English. Of course, there are some expressions, some new situations that I will get slow. Hay algunas expresiones que sí las voy a hacer más lentas. But most of the time we are going to speed it up. Le vamos a aumentar velocidad. So, if anything, if you don't quite catch something, let me know. Si hay algo que de verdad no me entendió nada, let me know. Okay? I can repeat again. I mean, it's not that I'm just going to be speaking and speaking and you are like gone. No trato de que yo esté solo hablando, hablando y ustedes nada. The idea is for, if I increase the speed, is for you to make the effort. But if it's too fast, la idea es que ustedes le metan un poquito más de esfuerzo. Pero si voy demasiado rápido, let me know. Okay, I can repeat as many times as necessary. So, let's see. Today we are going to start working on the manual. So, if you got your manuals handy, we are going to go to page number 29. Okay. Tw page number 29, we have a dialogue there that we are going to practice right now. And let me share with you guys. Let's see, where is it? It's right here. Okay. Let me see, I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. So we can have it all. Okay. It's a conversation between Peter and Henry. And the conversation goes like this. Let's see. The instruction is, listen to your teacher, read the conversation. Then practice with a partner. Okay. So let's see, guys. Let me just get something ready here. I'm going to send you the, the picture of the conversation. So you can have it. Okay, there you go. And I will also make the recording. So the conversation goes like this, guys. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. One more time. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So, I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So, I am informing the committee 
about it. I will repeat one more time. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year too. So, I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So, I am informing the committee about it. Oh. Okay, let's see, guys. Questions about the, the conversation? No? Cool. Let me get the group. Let me create them. Let's see. Perfect. Okay, guys. Practice. Three minutes. Jump in. Hurry up. Content. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee committee about it. Turn up. Your turn. You first. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So I see, but if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. Okay. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year too, so. I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am representing with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. That's that's a word, a committee. Yep. Teacher committee. Okay. Yes. You're Peter Sonia. Okay. okay. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year too. So I see. But if Julie is attending who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week. Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. Your okay. turn. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? 
Thanks, Thanks, Peter. Peter. Okay, guys, let's see. Group number one, Sonia and Vladimir, please, want to hear you. Okay. Yeah. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hi, Peter. With Maria is Julie is attending the conference this year too. So I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Yes, what I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. Perfect, guys. Thank you very much. Arvin and Walter Arana, please. Okay. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So. I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Girls, what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. So right. So I am informing the committee about it. The committee. Committee. Okay. The committee. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's see who's gonna be next. Okay, uh, Alfonso and Luis Armando, please. I start, teacher? Yes, please. Okay. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Mary is, but Julie is attending the conference this year to suit. I see, but if Julie is attending, who is delivering the present presentation for the CEO next week? Yes, but I am, I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sound great. So I am informing, informing the committee about it. Okay. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, guys. Now let's see. Next one is going to be Ivania and Mr. Ruiz. Please. Walter, you start. Hello, Henry. I had a question. Who is who is representing this company, the company in the, in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter, where well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year too, soon. I see, but it, it Julie is attending, who is delivering the, present, the presentation for the CEO next week. Get us what? I am I am presenting why Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. I, so I am informing to comment about it. Okay, thank you. Next is going to be Elwin and Evelyn. Elwin, you start. Hey teacher. Hello Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the year with conference. One moment, please. Okay. Evelyn, do you need the conversation? Yes, moment. Eso, estoy abriendo. <laughs> Don't worry, I got it for uh, you. Gracias. Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year. Uh, this year, too. So, I see. 
but if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Pues what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sound great. So I am informing the committee about it. Perfect, guys. Pristine, pristine. Excellent. Now let's see. And um, Elizabeth and Susanna. You start. Hi. Okay, you start, Elizabeth. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year too. So. I see about this is attending. Who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. So, okay. so I am informing the committee about it. Okay, ladies. Perfect, excellent. Now, let's go back to the conversation. Okay, listen again. Hello, Henry, I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter, well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year too. So, I see, but if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So, I am informing the committee about it. Okay, now let's see. Questions about the, the, the conversation, guys? No? No questions at all? No. Okay. Then let's see. Okay, okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Just give me a second, man. Just give me a second, please, guys. I'm sorry. Okay, now, if you say that there's no questions, I got questions for you. What is a CEO? Is the president of the company? Okay, yes, is the president of the company. But exactly, exactly when you say CEO, is the director of, comp of company? Yes, is the president or the director of the company. But the I guess the chief executive. chief executive officer, right? That's, that's the exact title. Ese es el título exactamente. The title of the position, the letters, the CEO stands for, okay? CEO stands for, okay, just give me a second. There you go. CEO stands for Chief Executive Officer. Okay. Chief is Jefe. Okay. That's it. Yes, Vladimir. No, I, I, uh, for example, at Central Bank, we have a CISO, CISO, Chief Information Security Officer. Yeah, yeah that's, I mean, that's the main boss. El, el, el de verdad. That's the main boss. Yeah, because, I mean, in the, in the, in the, 
in the organization we have different bosses right but the ceo is like the if depending on the company usually when you have a chief executive officer is sometimes it's because if the company is too big they have a board of directors normalmente si la compañía es muy grande tiene una mesa de directores yes a board of directors okay and the board of directors uh, they assign they they name ellos asignan nombra a ceo who is like the one who represents the board of directors that's if the well usually that happens in companies who are open in the ¿cómo decimos, cómo le llamamos a las compañías que están en el en la bolsa okay las compañías que se cotizan en la bolsa some of them work like that algunas de ellas trabajan así they got a board of directors and they have a ceo because sometimes the 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 main investors in some companies the main investor is the ceo en algunas compañías el el inversor mayoritario es el ceo but in some of them they assign the name one and algo otras ellos asignan o nombran uno who is in charge of all the operations but that ceo i mean in here we could assign that like the the president of the company or the main director of the company or the uh, uh, también podríamos aplicarle eso al gerente general it could apply here teacher in spanish ceo stands for el mero man yeah yeah that's that's the good one okay thank you thank you let's continue let's continue oh my Okay, here we go. Okay, guys, now in your manuals, in page number 30, this is something we saw yesterday. Esto es algo con lo que we worked yesterday, okay? How to use present continuous for future events. We use present continuous to talk about arrangements for events at a time later than now, okay? Look arrangements for events at a time later than now en un momento posterior a ahorita the structure simple subject the verb be as an auxiliary remember the main verb in gerum what is this ing cuando le pongan esto quiere decir que va en ing okay and complement okay well main verb in gerum mm, mm. Let's continue. Look at the example. I am meeting the interns tomorrow. If you see, when we say tomorrow, we are talking about an action that will take place in the future, okay? The action, when we say tomorrow, we are talking about future. What time is Maria interviewing the people? She's interviewing them at 5 p.m. She's in, actually, we don't pronounce that this T. Realmente no vamos a pronunciar esta T. Interviewing. She's interviewing them at 5 p.m. I am writing the report next week. Nice. And I am sending it as soon as you finish. Look, next week. It's future. As I was explaining to you yesterday, this is the way that we are going to make the difference between the present continuous for future and the present continuous for right now. Esta es la manera como diferenciamos el presente continuo para el futuro and for right in this moment. Okay, guys, let's see. I am having a little problem. Can you hear me properly? ¿Me escuchan bien? Yes? Yes. Yes, I yes. can hear you. Okay, okay, okay. Because according to this, de acuerdo a esto, my signal is gone. 
¿De acuerdo? Esto no tengo señal. So, if it cuts, si se nos corta la comunicación, wait for me. Ok. I have a backpack. Tengo un respaldo. Teacher, your ISP is Tigo. Yep. Uh, Tigo has problems all day with the yeah. internet. Yeah, all day it's been terrible. So, I am activating my backup right now. Yeah, Wi-Fi has been horrible, terrible. Okay, just let me see. I need to check out that I have the connection ready. Yes, it is ready. So if it goes down, wait for me, okay? Si se me pierde, me esperan. Don't go. No se me vayan a ir. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue. Do you remember that we, you had a homework? ¿Recuerdan la tarea? You were supposed to work in, in page number 30, some sentences, right? Yes. Okay, okay. We are going to work with that. Vamos a trabajar con ellas. Let me share with you. Okay, and it goes like this. Let's see. Number one says, sentence number one here says, Jose is receiving the new workers tomorrow. Sentence number two, please, Evelyn. Evelyn. Perdón. Mark is sending the letters the next week. Okay, the letters, the letters. Mark no. is sending the letters the new the next week. The next week. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay. okay. Sentence number three. Uh, Sonia. Okay. Jane is working on the reports tonight. On the report. On the reports tonight. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Number three. Sentence number three, Mr. Walter Arana. Number four, I'm sorry. Number four. Is Walter is signing the check today? Signing. Signing. Yes, signing. Okay, Walter is signing the check today. Perfect. Okay. Now, number five. Number five goes to, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Walter Ruiz. Um, hmm. Give me a second, teacher. Yeah, no problem. Um, Marina is our... Okay, or garnishing the presentation, the presentation in the afternoon. Okay, Marina is organizing. Marina is organizing the presentation in the afternoon. Okay, and number six, let's see. Number six goes to Susana. Okay. Guillermo is going to the bank tomorrow. Okay. Guillermo is going to the is going to the bank tomorrow. Perfect. Excellent. I repeat, I will repeat all the sentences. Number one, Jose is receiving the new workers tomorrow. 
Mark is sending the letters the next week. Jane is working on the reports tonight. Walter is signing the checks today. Marina is organizing the presentation in the afternoon. Guillermo is going to the bank tomorrow. If you notice, all of them use the time expression at the end. Next week, tonight, okay? In the afternoon, tomorrow. It says today, Walter is signing the checks today. It's not saying right now, está diciendo este día, not in this moment, okay? Now, before we move on, I will take the attendance again. Tomaremos la asistencia de nuevo. Okay, just give me a second. Let's see, Alfonso Antonio Cabrera. Present teacher. Thank you. Arvin Enrique Ramos Mundo. Present teacher. Thank you. Berta Maritza Molina absent. Claudia Guadalupe Alfaro absent. Daisy Elizabeth Celaya Gómez. Present teacher. Edwin Daniel Sevillano Veras. Present teacher. Evelyn Patricia Caballero de Molina. Present teacher. Ivania Elizabeth Rodríguez Ramos. Present teacher. Karen Lisette García Rodríguez. Luis Armando Leiva Rodas. Present teacher. Mauricio Arnoldo Quintanilla Cuellar. Is here. Oscar Armando Rodríguez Rodríguez. Ricardo Alberto Hernández Monge. Absent. Roxana Claribel Trejos de Pérez. Absent. Sandra Yanira Moreno Sarabia. Ok, no here. Let's see. Uh, Sonia Mabel Lazo González. Present. Susana Carolina Hernández Siraeta. Present. Vladimir Antonio Martínez Molina. Present teacher. Walter Alexander Arana Cortés. Present teacher. Walter José Ruiz Ayala. Present teacher. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Now, let's see. Sonia, tell me, tell me something that you are doing this this week, an activity that you have programmed, arranged for this week. This week, um, uh, this week, I am preparing comparative Comparative uh, report the service. Okay. Comparative report. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You explained to me it yesterday. Mm -hmm. I think, creo que ayer me comentó eso. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Now, let's see. What about you, Walter Arana? Tell me an activity that you are performing this week. This week. Uh, I am um, preparing report. The payment and transport and survey. Payments. 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 Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. What about you, Edwin? Tell me something that you are doing this week. I am. Um, um, oh. Installation GPS. Okay. What about on Saturday? Uh, you are doing something on Saturday, I remember. For the morning, uh, test driving. Okay. In afternoon. Check out what I just sent you. You taking are taking a driving test. Taking a driving test. Okay. You are the, taking for, a driving test. I am working for the afternoon. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. 
Let's see, Vladimir, what about you? Tell me something that you are doing this week. This week, well, I am attending some meetings in this week and I am going to register for uh, some webinars. Oh, webinars. Well, you're going to be busy. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Yes. What about you, Alfonso? Tell me something that you are doing this week. Sorry, DJ, I have a problem my, my, with the microphone. Repeat them, please. Tell me something that you are doing this week, an activity that you're performing this week. In this week, um, um, the, not the notification, the, the new project, project, my web workplace okay oh yeah and you're working on new on new machines right yes excellent the, the insta the installing the new machine machines. perfect we are installing the new machines like that yes. we are installing the new machines we are the installing the new machines we are installing. We are installing. Perfect. Excellent, excellent. Now let's see, let's see. What about you, Arvin? Arvin, tell me something that you are doing tomorrow, please. Excuse me, teacher, repeat, please. Can you tell me something that you are doing tomorrow? Um, lo que yo hago mañana? No, algo que va a hacer mañana. Oh, okay. Um, I'm work. Uh, I am work. Working. Uh, I am working. I am working in, in the morning. Okay. Um, the afternoon meetings uh, uh, in the class. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Susana, hello. You here? Yes, I'm here. Okay, Susana, cool. Tell me, please, Susana, tell me something that you are doing this week. Okay, this week I have to present uh, two reports. Okay, One, I am uh, I am presenting. I am presenting two reports. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. What about you, Evelyn? Tell me something that you are doing this week. I am uh, visiting my mom. Oh, cool. Excellent. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, <laughs> if, you, if you see, we are using the present continuous to talk about the future. Now we go back again to the manual, okay? I'm going to share with you this screen. Okay, guys, we go to page number 31. Okay, okay. We have here two questions. Who is the first person to arrive at your workplace? And what is the first thing you do when you get to your workplace? We have those two questions to work with right now. Tenemos esas dos oraciones, dos preguntas to work right now okay who is the first person to arrive at your workplace and what is the first thing you do when you get to your workplace okay those two questions you are going to ask to your partners okay hold on just give me a second Okay, you will have three minutes exact for doing this activity. Van a tener tres minutos. I am so sorry, Nese. No me voy a mover a los rooms porque normalmente cuando me muevo ya está la señal super baja. 
me desconecta, ok, so I'm going to stay here, I'm going to be counting the time, so hurry up, ok, so let me create, recreate the groups, ok, and you need to ask your classmates those two questions. Who is the first person to arrive to your workplace? And what is the first thing you do when you get there? Okay. So, guys, please jump in. Get in the groups. Okay, we are just waiting here for them to come due to connection problems we are not I am not going to go to the rooms to check out the events but I'm waiting here and taking note of the time
Teacher, I have a question. Tell me, Alfonso. Ah, okay. Me permite one moment. Uh, solo responder algo a uh, WhatsApp. No is, problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. Is bad, bad notice. Oh. Others, or, uh, perdón, otro compañero me están diciendo que eh, ha fallecido. Entonces solo oh. quiero mandar las condolencias. Ok, ok. I'm so sorry for that. Thank so, one moment, please. Yeah, no problem, no problem, no problem. Thank you. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. So I'm going to ask Sonia, tell me, who do you work with? Yeah. Repeat, please. Who do you work with? ¿Con quién trabajó? Hello, uh, I came back, like teacher. Lo escucho cortado, pero with Vladimir and Edwin. Okay, tell me about uh, Edwin. Okay. Edwin va a compartir. Deme un momento. Sonia. Se la voy a enviar al uh -huh. pasado. Vaya, pues, no está. Ok, I just saw it. He sent it to the group. Ok, who is the first person to arrive at Edwin's workplace? That's the question. Um, the first person uh, in her work is the vigilant. Okay, two things, Sonia. His. Yes, in his, huh? in his. Yo que le dije. Her. No. Yeah, <laughs> come on, Sonia, come yeah. on. It's Edwin, it's Edwin, come on. Be careful. No, no. His. Okay. Is the... the vigilant. Okay, <laughs> hold on, hold on. In this case, we are talking about the security guard. Security guard. Guard. Okay. Teacher. Yes, Edwin. Eso les explicaba que no era se seguridad, es vigilante. Why? Seguridad es el otro que lo acompaña a él, pero el primero que viene es vigilante. Why? De por, por la empresa. Ok, hold on, hold on. Tell me what's the difference in your company. ¿Cuál es la diferencia ahí? ¿Cómo se dice? No usa armas. Oh, he's not armed. Uh -huh, he's not armed. Por eso le habíamos puesto vigilant. Okay. Y security guard es armado, ¿verdad? Security guard. Security guard. guard. Okay. Guard. Now, yes, but still cannot be vigilant. Y entonces, ¿cómo sería ahí? The problem is this. Uh, Una persona vigilante, I'm sorry, I will explain in Spanish. Eh, vigilante uh -huh. es un adjetivo que utilizamos en español para decir, para referirnos a alguien que está atento. Ok. Como por ejemplo, cuando iniciamos este curso, a mí me dijeron que yo debía de estar muy vigilante a sus aciertos y sus errores en la pronunciación. You get it? ¿Captamos el contexto? O sea, en este caso, siempre... Como les dije, yo tenía que estar vigilante no con sus... Ok. Can you hear me now? ¿Me oyen ahora? Ya. Yes. Ok. Ok. Yo les explicaba que cuando decimos vigilante nos referimos a alguien que está atento, presto a... Ok. Eso es vigilante, como por ejemplo, yo les digo que yo debo de estar muy vigilante de sus aciertos y errores en pronunciación. Ok. So, in this case, it's still a guard. En este caso aún es un guard, un guardia. 
¿ok? Just that it's not armed, simplemente que no está armado. Ok, okay. I'm sorry, eh, perdón, desconecto la cámara por instantes due to the signal para que me logren escuchar. Because I'm losing connection totally. According to my computer, I don't have access to internet. De acuerdo a mi computadora, no tengo acceso al internet. I don't know how am I teaching. Creo que pura brujería está caminando eso. <laughs> okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Now, uh, let me see. And tell me, Sonia, what is the first thing you do when you get to your workplace? The first thing he does is eat pupusas in the morning. Oh, really? Okay, no comments. Yes. No comments. Now, let's see. Uh, Vladimir, tell me about... Uh, well, no, Edwin, tell me about Vladimir. Okay, teacher. Oh, yes. No, it was just Edwin and Sonia. Solamente era Edwin y Sonia, ¿verdad? No, and Vladimir. Okay, no, tell me about Vladimir. Vladimir. Me permite un momento. Yeah, no problem, no problem. Oh. I understand. Vladimir, tell me about Sonia, please. Uh, sorry, teacher. I am the cell phone. Yep, and I don't hear you. Y no le escuché. I'm sorry, Vladimir. The signal is terrible today. Creo que la señal se está muriendo hoy para todo el mundo. Now, let's see. Let's see. I'm sorry. We are going to come back to this group later. Let's see. Evelyn, you were working with Arvin and Mauricio, right? With Arvin. With uh, Arvin. Yes, I, I yes, yes. Tell me about Arvin, Evelyn. Yes. Um, in the case of Arvin, with this person in his workplace, is the cook to bread. Uh, when Arvin get to his show up, um, he is starting his works area. Okay, area, area. Area. Okay, excellent. Arvin, tell me about Evelyn, please. Okay. Um, she, she not sure in first person um in her workplace okay and okay. what is the first um, thing she does excuse me what is the first thing she does ¿Qué es lo primero que ella hace? um okay uh, she she checking your uh, excuse me she's checking uh, her email Okay. The first thing she does is to check her email. Excellent. Perfect. Yes. Yes. Thank you very much, Arvin. Susana, you were working with Elizabeth and Walter Ruiz, right? Yes, but we don't finish. We didn't finish. No. Okay, who do you have the information from? The Kimeti information. I have information that um, Elizabeth. Yes. Remember the first person to arrive the office her Elizabeth is the watchman. Okay. And what about you, Susana? Who is the first person who arrives to your workplace? Tell me. Uh, the first person to arrive uh, is the parking attendant. Okay, to arrive, Susana, arrive. To arrive, arrive, arrive. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much, Susana. Okay, okay now let's see. Uh, Walter Ruiz, tell me, who is the first person to arrive to your company? Uh, my company, the first person is Varios Trades. I'm sorry. Are you trainers? 
Office of Values. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know what you mean. And tell me, what is the very first thing you do when you arrive to to your office? Uh, when I check my in, I take a cup of co uh, cup of coffee. Okay, to get a cup cup of coffee. Cup of coffee. Okay, thank you very much. Excellent. Oh, okay, teacher. Now let's see. Let's see. Let's see. <clears throat> Walter Arana, tell me, who is the first person to arrive to your company? Uh, you. In your case, your company. Okay, este, the first person to arrive, to arrive in, in workplace is uh, the one in shirt of cleaning. Okay. Yes, yes, perfect. The one okay. in charge, in charge, in charge. In charge. Charge, charge, charge. Charge. Perfect. Yeah, charge of cleaning. Excellent. And tell me, what is the first thing you do when you get to your office? Um, is the first thing I breakfast. Okay, to have breakfast. Yes. Excellent. Thank you. Now let's see. Luis Armando, tell me who is the first person to arrive to your company. Sorry, teacher. Repeat, please. Who is the first person to arrive to your company? ¿Quién okay. es el primero en llegar? Uh, the first person is the cleaning department. Okay. And tell me, what is the first thing you do when you get to the company? What? What is the first thing you do when you get to the company? ¿Qué es lo primero que usted hace cuando llega? Oh, okay. Uh, I, I clean my desk. Okay. I clean my desk. Perfect, thank you very much. Now, let's see the, uh, 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 where, Ivania. Hello, Ivania. Hi, teacher. Hello, Ivania. Tell me, who is the first person to arrive to your company? Um, I feel first person um, arrive the office and, um, Okay, well, it's mm, a brother company. Brother company. <laughs> okay, thank you. Interesting. And tell me, Evelyn, what is the first thing you do when you get to the company? I don't understand. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Evelyn. It wasn't for you. It was Ivania's. I'm sorry. My bad. No, okay. No, okay. <laughs> okay. What is the first thing you do when you get to the company? Um, number one, I have, I don't know, I go breakfast and and review, revisar, review, co email. Check. Check email, pero. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see, who's missing? ¿Quién me faltó? Mm -hmm. Elizabeth, you are missing. No, teacher. Tell me, Elizabeth. Uh, what is the very first thing you do when you get to the company? Is the security guard. 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 Oh. Security guard. 
Okay, thank you very much. And tell me what is the first thing you do? ¿Qué es lo primero que usted hace, Elizabeth? I I eat pancake in coffee. <laughs> okay. So you have breakfast. Yes. I be breakfast. Okay, okay. Just give me a second, guys. I check report. Okay. No, I write. I write report. You write reports. Reports. I report. Thank you very much, Elizabeth. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Vladimir, you back? Yes, teacher. Sorry, my internet is a uh, garbage. <laughs> Well, don't worry, don't worry. No se preocupe. A mí esta cosa me dice, la computadora is giving me a... According to this, I don't have access to internet. De acuerdo, esto yo no tengo acceso al internet, but... Awesome. The class is working. Let's hope it gets recorded. Okay. Esperemos que se grabe. If okay. We are, you are going to have an extra class. Si no se graba, no se preocupe, tendremos una clase extra. <laughs> okay. For real. And that's not a big deal. Don't worry. Okay, let's see. Tell okay. me, Vladimir, who is the very first person who arrived to your company? Well, the first person to arrive at Central Bank is security guard. Okay, and tell me what is the very first thing you do when you get to your working area? Okay, the first things that I do when I go to... When I get to my workplace, I'm greeting to everybody that comes before me. I. Okay. Do you hear me? Yes. Greet. Hello. I greet. I, I greet. Saludo a todo mundo. Yes. I greet. Okay. okay. I greet to everybody. I greet everybody. Well, actually, mm -hmm. you can say everybody like, to. You can say like this: I greet everyone. Okay, I greet everyone that comes before me. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, let's okay. continue. Thank you. Let's go back to the manual. We are going to go back to the manual because we have another conversation. Okay, let me get this. This is a long conversation, guys. Just give me a second. Okay, the conversation goes like this. And it says, Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay, I'm going to pronounce one more time, guys. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. 
They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay, let's see, let's see. I think there's no problems with uh, vocabulary, right? Creo que estamos bien con vocabulario. No questions? No? Okie dokie. Okay, guys, you are just going to have three minutes to practice this conversation. Okay, I am creating the groups. Let's see. Just give me, okay, I need to change. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry, I, I'm just fixing a little something with the groups. No. Perfect, guys. Let's go. Let's jump in. Three minutes. I'll be waiting here for you. Lo estaré esperando acá. What happened, teacher? Everybody's in the groups. The groups? Yes. No tiene la invitación al grupo. Yes. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? The conversation. I just sent it to you. Ya se las envié. Ah, ah. Igual que el anterior. Yep. Okay. Okay, and again, we are going to be waiting here for everybody to come back due to the fact that the connection is unstable today.
Okay, time to call them back. seconds for them to finish. Okay, guys, everybody's coming right now. And let's see who's going to be first. The very first couple is going to be, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, the boss is just asking me something. Just give me a second. just reporting right now the problems with the signal guys but the very first is going to be Edwin and Elizabeth yes, uh, let's see Elizabeth you start Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, a conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see, but I do you usually get to your workplace? What the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6 3 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email and you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30 in depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick out the letter. Thanks. Okay. okay, yes, perfect. Thank you. I'm just checking. Arrive. I usually arrive. Okay. And remember, okay. guys, usually, usually. Now, let's see. Next is going to be um, Alfonso and Luis Armando. Uh, I start, teacher? Yes, please, Alfonso. Okay. Good afternoon, Raul. What are, what are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is our team right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to, you, to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? 
I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. The conference with the new team, okay? The conference with, okay, Alfonso? With, W-I-T-H, with, okay? And with. remember, arrive. Thank you very much, guys. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Arvin and Walter Arana, please. Okay, teacher. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Uh, well, I am playing on playing a video conference. Oh, the conference why the new team in San Salvador? Where is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are heading ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at the 6, 3 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email and you. Well, I arrive at 7 on, or 7.30, it depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the litter. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, at the end, I will repeat it again for everybody. Al final se la voy a repetir yo para todos, okay? Because I want to listen to all of you. Now, Evelyn and Susanna, please, Evelyn, you are going to start. Okay. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team down right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30, depending on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Let me check who's going to be next. Next one is Vladimir and Walter Ruiz. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes. Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What is the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. Uh, the first thing I do is to check my email and you. Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30 in the on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay. Perfect. Thank you very much. Very well done, guys. Now, let's see. Next one are Ivania and Sonia. So, Sonia, you are Ryan. Ivania, you are Raul. Okay. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new teams in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. 
that are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to work, to your workplace? What the first things you do? I usually arrive at six thirty a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my emails. And you? Well, I arrive at seven or seven thirty. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Very well done. Now, let me pronounce it again for all of you guys. It goes like this. Let's see. Okay, like this. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with, listen up guys, the conference with, that's the way we pronounce this word, okay? The conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is our team, our, remember, our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. Meeting. Remember, this T, we make it an R. Esta T la convertimos en R. Meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive, arrive, okay? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay, guys, now, this activity, uh, it's something of what we did today. I need you to please check this information. This is very simple. How to use simple present versus present continuous. The simple present, you know, I've been explaining, is used for general information, routine activities, okay? Focus on this, routine activities. Usually, something that I was explaining yesterday, we use the present continuous for ongoing actions. When we say ongoing actions, we are talking about something that is happening right in this moment. Si digo ongoing, es, quiere decir que están sucediendo en este momento. Okay? Ongoing actions at the time of speaking. So look, I check my email every morning. I am planning a video conference. This is happening in this moment. Estoy planeando una videoconferencia. Okay? He writes reports about a meeting. They are getting the documents ready. They are getting. She audits inventories. She is editing the information. They arrange meetings. The secretary is making a phone call. Okay. Now, this is homework for you. Exercise four, page number 32 is homework, okay? Part A and part B. Parte A y parte B. Okay, these two are homework for you. Page number 32, exercise four, part A and part B. In part A, complete the sentences in present continuous. In part B, write in the boxes the activities you usually do on a Monday morning, okay? Four activities. I need you to write full sentences. Necesito que escriban oraciones completas. Now, before we, we leave, antes que nos vayamos, remember, when we use 
the present continuous for expressing ongoing actions at the moment that we are speaking, there's no uh, time expression. Or if there is, it's right now. Normalmente cuando utilizo el presente continuo para expresar algo que está sucediendo en este momento, no necesito una time expression. Y si lo hago, la que ubico es en este momento, right now. That would be for us in Salvadorian, that would be like ahorita. Okay? That's the only And one. today? If you say today, it's future. Y ahí es futuro. No. Because it, it, refer, it could refer to another time in the same day, porque podría referirse a otro momento del mismo día. Más del adelante. día. Yes. Okay? So remember, no time expression, or if there's one, is right now. No hay una time expression, o en el dado caso que haya, la time expression that is going to appear is right now. Any question? Um, yes. Uh, it's cor it is correct, say, in this moment. Yes. But what is not what? correct, what, I, what was not correct was your question, Sonia. ¿Mm? Lo que me dijo, sí. Lo que no estaba del todo bien era la pregunta. <risa> Vaya, ¿cómo le pregunté? Okay. Pues? The, the proper way to ask is this. Is it correct to say? Y yo le dije, it is, ¿verdad? Yes, you say a something in an affirmative Horrible. form. Me lo dijo en afirmativo. And I understand because in Spanish we make the questions like that. En español así la hacemos, decimos, es correcto. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, you can say in this moment, you can say right now. Okay. 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 Right now and in this moment is exactly the same. Okay. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. I really appreciate you being here and being patient with me. Realmente aprecio que hayan conmigo y hayan sido pacientes. Eh, Alfonso, we are staying, right? Okay. See you tomorrow. Take yes. care. Don't forget my homework and work in the platform. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night, Good night everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Okay, let's see. Ivania, I don't know if you're frozen or you're still here. No sé si se me congeló, todavía está acá. Okay, but we are going to do something. This. Okay, Alfonso, tell me, how can I help you today? ¿En qué le ayudamos este día? Um... Can we use this moment of practice speaking? Yes, sure, sure, sure. It's perfect. It's actually, yes. I like it that you want to talk to me. So tell me, uh, where do you live, Alfonso? I live in San Martin. Where do you live? Oh, um, I live in, in Nuevo Cuscatlán. Okay, Nuevo Cuscatlán. Right in the town or in the outside? No, in... Downtown. Downtown, yes. Okay, perfect. perfect. Tell me, have you lived there all your life? Your whole life? Or just some years? I lived, I've been living in San Martin for almost 20 years. Before I used to live in Soyapango, what about you? Have you lived in Nuevo Cuscatlán all your life or just a few years? Um, sorry, teacher. Eso último no, no lo entendí. Okay, I'm not using Spanish. All okay. your life. Look in the chat. Uh, 
Almost. Um, okay, all your life or just oh. some years? No. Uh, um, Podría decir. I could say. Decir que sí. Okay. Yes. All I, your life for. Um, of the the uh, six years 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 old. Okay. I am uh, since. Repeat with me. Since I was. Since. Since, since I, I was. I was. Six years old. Since I was six years old. Yes, because I imagine that you are saying this, right? No, oh, right. Original. Where um, were you born? In San Salvador, in Sonsonate. Where were you born? No, in Nueva Concepción. That's a Chalate? No. Chalatenango. Yes. yes. Man, yes, Chalatenango. that's far. It's a long distance. Yes. Okay, that's nice. <clears throat> Tell me, do, uh, you, do you live with your parents or do you live alone? Uh, my with my mom. Okay. So my, what my is mom and me. aunt? Tia? No, tío. Okay, uncle. To f uncle. Uncle. Okay. Uh, so, uh, uh, to, to family, my mom is is fierce, and to uh, my uncle. Okay. So we refer to them as relatives. Two relatives. Okay. Two relatives. Okay. Well, actually, one relative, your uncle. The other one is your mother. Okay. And. Mm -hmm. And so tell me, uh, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, I was <laughs> asking you, who do you live with? And you told me that you live with your mom and your uncle. What is your mother's name? He, um, her name is? He, her, her name is uh, Angela. Okay, how old is she? How old is she? Yes, I am 41 years old. How old is your mother? He's uh, she? she, sorry, she she is uh, 49 years old. 49 years old. Man, yes. She's young. 40. Yes, she's 49. very young. She is very young. Yes. <laughs> how, how old are you, Alfonso? Uh, uh, I am 31 years old. 21? 31. 31. 30. Okay, 30. yeah. You are young. You are young. What about your uncle? What's his name? What's your uncle's name? His, his name is uh, Rafael. Okay, how old is he? How old, how old is your uncle? I repeat the like question. That. Yes, I am 41 years old. How old is your uncle? Oh, uh, the, his uncle. He is, he is, is say he is. His, his uncle? He is, you don't say he. You just, we don't say uncle. You just say he is. Oh, repeat, teacher. You have to say it like this. He is, hold on, just give me a second. I will text it to you. Okay, okay. He is uncle. No, no uncle. No, no the uncle. Age, ah. The age, the number. He is. Is um, 
El... Creo que... Sixteen mm. uh, Oh, he's older. He's 69 years old. He's older. Yes. Es una, es, uh, 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 ¿Cómo se dice? Aproximado. Approximately. Approximately. Uh, or you can tell me like this. He's around 68, 69. He's around. 68, 69. Correct. Okay. In... Um, and week and, and week, yeah. Next semana and week. Yes, this weekend or this week. This week, okay, is uh, para decir fiestas patronales. Oh, really? The parties, the festivities. Festivities. Oh, Correct. yeah. You told me. You told me. You told me last week. Yes, are the party there and then. Yes. Well, yes, be careful. Be careful. Wear a mask. Uh, I'm, um, you para are decir, not, yo no salgo. I don't go out. I don't go. Uh, I don't go out. Yeah, we uh, have to be careful. Offer no, no, no party in the moment. Oh yeah, they are canceled. Canceled. Yes. Uh, solo para decir solo. Else? Just. 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 And the pol la pólvora. Okay, the firecrackers. Well, the fire. Fi no, in this case, is fireworks. The fireworks. Ah, well, um, because if we say firecrackers, we refer specifically to Five. firecrackers is what we call here in El Salvador cohetes, okay? Cohetes. But fireworks are the lights and everything. The luces. Okay, yes, that's why we say fireworks, okay? Yes. Uh, para decir tengo una tradición. Okay, I have a tradition. I have a tradition. Uh, to eat, yes, uh, de los churritos españoles. Oh, really? You like them? Yes, yeah. is tradition. My um, it's a others is it's a tradition for me. It's a tradition for me. Oh, for that's cool. That's cool. All the other, uh, and all, all parties. All, 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 todas las ocasiones que vienen. Yeah, for, is, for the whole, is, the whole parties, all the occasions, you do it. That's good. Okay. That's good. You Siempre like tengo it. que ir por uno. <laughs> well, excellent, excellent. If you enjoy them, that's cool. Si usted lo disfruta, está bien. Yes. Nothing more is, uh, para decir este año, ¿no? This year, oh, this year, but this year, but, but this year, oh, but this year, oh, okay, with, or with the exception of this year, yeah, because of the, of the pan pandemia. yeah, for the pandemics, we oh. have to be careful, well, yes. it was a, it was a good conversation, Alfonso, uh, oh, thank you very thank much. You, teacher. Look, I'm going to have some space one of these days. I will let you know. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, let's see. Let's see. When do I have more space? Because I think I have. I will have more space for you. Let me check it. Um, tomorrow, no. Tomorrow is Wednesday, Thursday, perhaps. I'm Thursday. not sure. Yeah, but perhaps on Thursday. Okay. Thursday. Yep. Jueves. Yep. So, okay, yes. If you want, let me know. Okay. See. 
Okay. If you need a space, let me know, okay? You know. or, or if you want to practice more, for me, it's okay. For, 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 for me, excellent. <laughs> okay, okay, perfect. Thank you, you practice, very much. Practice. Yes, yes, it's good to practice all the time. See you tomorrow. And Thank you, teacher. Take care. Have a good See night. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Okay, we are going to give it uh, like one or two minutes perhaps we don't lose connection and to see to check out if we can like well to make up the few seconds that got lost on the connection due to the bad signal for this night this night the signal the service has been terrible let's hope it improves for next sessions because we need to practice a lot with our students that's very important like today we were working with present continuous in order to express future which is very interesting mostly because um, that's a way of thinking that we don't actually have here and in spanish in spanish we don't think quite that way i mean we think of in future of course but Specifically, the way of thinking, it's kind of complex because we mostly here in Salvador, we use a one tense that uh, infers both idea. And in English, I mean, in English, we have more ways to express the future. So it makes it kind of complex or difficult for some students to understand. But it's mostly something that, that they will get through practice. Well, let's hope everything goes okay. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.